Hey guys, Magnus Robert here bringing you a video uh, on another Dead Walking Dead character. Now I just want to say, after this video there will be five more uh, of these daily uploads of these Walking Dead character profiles. There will be five more, and then after that we will continue with these just being every Friday or Saturday. Um, and then it's just, I just wanted to catch up to my schedule. So, sorry about that. But anyway... Today we're going to be bringing another video on another dead character. This one is on Karen, f uh, former girlfriend to Tyrese and also former teacher. Karen is of course female. She is played by Melissa Ponzio. She is mid to late 30s and first appeared in Suicide King. Uh, before the apocalypse, Karen was a teacher and Noah was likely one of her students. She likely lived near Woodbury when the outbreak began and she and Noah joined Woodbury and lived inside the walls of the community. In season 3, Karen demands to be let out after Rick's attack. She watches in horror as Richard Foster is, dies and is put down by the governor. She is also calmed down by Andrea. She then has guard duty and also argues that Noah shouldn't be a part of the governor's army because he's too young and has asthma. She basically claims that he is her son, even though this is not true. She's lying. She goes on the raid to the prison but retreats when overwhelmed by walkers and flashbangs. She protests to the governor on the road after he pulls them to the side, and then the governor open fires on the group. She hides under a dead body, scared when the governor is going around finishing off people, but luckily he, he's out of bullets and he doesn't notice her. She then hides in a truck and is found by Daryl, Rick and Michonne. She tells them what happened and then they go back to Woodbury, getting Tyrese to lower his gun. She is then later brought back to the prison with the others to live there. And then after the time skip in season 4, Karen is shown to be a keen member of the prison community and develops a relationship with Tyrese. Karen is seen on fence duty killing walkers, Tyrese visits her kissing her and then he goes on a supply run. Karen and Tyrese talk and go to sleep. She investigates the shower uh, where there is a dead Patrick but luckily she is not killed by him and she survives. Uh, she also survives the attack that happens when the turned residents uh, obviously turn and start attacking. She then eventually gets sick from the flu that is going on in the prison and she's quarantined. However, Carol, uh, concerned about the well-being of the rest of the members, does this. She kills her to stop the illness spreading. Later, she then burns her body along with David, another member of the prison, and then her body is found by Tyrese, who is very sad. She is later buried in the prison grounds. Karen was an interesting minor character, and I enjoyed her presence in the show. Her character was really there to set up this mystery, but in season 3 she was quite useful as well as like a recognisable Woodrian. Uh, Woodrian? I guess that's what you call them. But yeah, her death made a really cool mystery and also helped Tyrese develop as a character. Anyway, thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, tell me your thoughts on Karen. I thought she was pretty cool, I know she's pretty minor, but I am just doing minor characters at the minute. So yeah, thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed, I'll see you next one. Goodbye.